Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, Acorn here. Uh, today we're going to take a break from all the surviving and the running around in Outlast and avoiding death. And we're just going to play this chill little alpha game. Um, this is Stone Hearth Alpha 1. So, uh, as you can tell, it's very early alpha down here. It's got Stone Hearth version 0.1. Uh, this is a Kickstarter game I backed uh, a little while ago. Um, it's a cool little game. You build towns and stuff like that. But they just released this alpha about a month ago, shortly after Christmas. So two months ago, actually. I'm forgetting the time of year it is. Uh, and yeah, it, there's not much in it. But I just thought it'd be a fun little thing to check out. Uh, show you guys what I'm in here. So we're doing the quick start. Ooh, look at that thing. That is not in the game yet. I'm probably glad because it looks like it could hurt my villagers. But, like I said, it only has a few little things in it. Uh, basically to give you an idea of what you're going to be doing in the full game. Um, I can tell it's kind of like a... Uh, like a um, what was it? A dwarf fortress or a... Uh, um, what's the name of that one? Nemoria or... Ah, there's one more. I can't remember it. Anyway, we have to find a place to settle our town, and boom, I see a perfect place right here. Turn this around. But we got plenty of bushes here to harvest berries, and plenty of wood all around. So, click to place the banner, and let's just stick it right there. Boom! Look, we got villagers. What have we got? Oh, I can't click on them yet. Oh, I have to place my stockpile. Stockpile is where everyone puts all the wood and berries they gather. So we're going to put it right here next to the wooden berries so I don't have to travel far. Onward! The rest is up to you. Start by gathering wood and stone resources, then building a workshop. No problem. I played through this a little bit already. Uh, let's see. Start by... Gather that tree, that tree, that tree, that tree, that tree. So I'll select what I want them to do and see they're harvesting wood. I chop down trees and bring it back to our stockpile. I'm gonna start uh, getting these berries as well because we need food. And this is gonna be the town center. At night they'll light this fire and they'll all gather around uh, first. Let's see who we have here. We have Gareth Edessa. He is a psychopathic mis misanthrope. That's always good. Uh, let's see. Willid Freywind, insufferable academic. Right now we're looking for someone who can be a carpenter. Leah Framer, hopeless optimist. All right. Oh, who are you? Alina Hunterton, Diligent Sweetheart. Oh, she is going to be a good carpenter, I think. So we do. The saw is for the carpenter. See, it's a saw. So, we can promote somebody. Boom. We choose a citizen. We are looking for Elena Hunterton. She looks good. Approve. Watch this. Oh, oh, look at that. All right, look at that. He's got a nice little overalls on. She is our carpenter. So, what we have to do is... No, stockpile. Atlanta, we have to place her carpenter's workshop. So, we're going to put it right next to the stockpile so she doesn't have to go very far. And we also want to put her stockpile. This is where she'll put all the stuff that she builds. So there we go. And look, she's going to take a block of wood. And see, there. She made her workbench. Now what we have to do is click on here. She can build stuff. First thing we want to make, we want to make some beds. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six villagers. Got to make six beds. All right, and we'll get these guys back to working. 
Cutting down more trees, getting more wood. There we go. Let them go to work. Ooh, bunnies. Can't do anything with the bent rabbits yet. Ooh, a rabbit. Om nom nom. Uh, they haven't implemented interaction with any of the animals yet. I believe there are sheep in here as well. Yep, look, sheep. Sheep, so fluffy! That will be a reference, possibly, to Despicable Me, maybe. All right, so beds. We want to place the beds. We'll just place them along here for now. Uh, you can move stuff eventually. Or, you, I can move stuff that has already been placed. But right now, we're just going to put them along here. Ooh, she's building fast. Placing down our beds so that they can go sleepy buys when they want to. Oh, here's more berries. And look at all these people. Yeah, look at Leah. Marianne Baub. The leaguered leader. Oh, she might have been a good, uh, carpenter as well. On arriving, everyone seems to be gotten here okay. Well, almost everyone. Uh-oh, did we lose someone? Oh, another bed is done. Oh. Johnny? Oh no, she's just putting it in the stockpile. Okay, we'll pick it back up. Marianne, put it there. I don't know if you saw, everyone has different stats. Like on hearing the call of the saw. Me? Carpenter? You want me to be a carpenter? Okay, I'll do my best. Uh, they have these stats. Um, I haven't really figured out what all the stats are yet. Like I said, this is very early alpha. Oh, look, he's starting a fire. Okay. Oh. Warm yourself by the fire, my friend. Oh, another bed. Didn't get all the beds done before nightfall, so someone is going to be sleeping on the ground. But that's okay. It's just the first night. Uh, they haven't implemented monsters or anything yet, so I don't have to worry about that. They're just chilling by the fire. Uh, when they get hungry, they'll come and eat on their own accord. And what does she need? She's got one bed there. Uh, we want to build... Where is it? Simple wooden chairs. It takes one wood resource, and when you're sitting, you get 20% more satisfying food. 10,000 years of research culminated in this four-legged design. Alright. It's a cathedral arch chair. Ooh, takes more wood. Does the same thing, but... Table? Better than eating standing up, unless you're watching your weight. Dining furniture for introverts. Ooh. Allows a group of people to all eat together, like grown-ups. Well, we're not going to do that yet. We're just going to make simple wooden chairs. And we'll make six. You can see we can make six right now, and you can make it so they'll always maintain a certain number in your inventory. Since this is like very early off alpha, um, not a whole lot going on, we don't need to really do much of that right now. Let's see, what else we got? Wood, we already talked to him. Elena, already talked to her. Leah, already checked her out. Marianne, Gareth, Elena, Bob. What do we do, Bob? No, we got more Bob. We got multiple Bobs. Uh, top reason chopping trees is fun. Perfect, perfecting the swing of the axe. May be useful one day. Uh oh, she sounds dangerous. She's a lovable rogue. Who's the other Bob we had? Bob. Marianne. So Marianne and Elena are sisters, I'm guessing. Hunterton, Framer, Odessa, Redwin. Okay, no one else's siblings. Oh hey, we have some sheep right here. So fluffy! Like there's a few more things we can build. We have to wait till daytime, though. I don't know if you can speed stuff up. But... I'm going to chop stuff down. Oh, look, they'll come and do that at night. Okay. Work through the night. When they get tired, they'll go and sleep. Like, Willard here is sleeping. Sleepy, sleepy. Oh, yawn, stretch. Three days have passed since I had a decent philosophical conversation. Trying not to panic. Failing. Trying to keep it in. Succeeding. Mostly. I'm mostly succeeding. Mostly. 
All right. They're gathering wood. Man, they're working tonight. I didn't expect them to do that. I thought they always just kind of gathered around the campfire at night. But I believe it's almost day. We can get some chairs, put around the fire. Say two there, two there, and two there. That way they don't have to sit on the floor like that. Or ground. There's no floor there. Silly acorn. I see they're warming up. Just chilling. Oh, that's just the crafting thing. You make tools and weapons and armor. It doesn't do anything yet, but that's how you make guards and swordsmen and the like, which you'll need when monsters are implemented. You see, we get this little world. I'm not sure if it's going to be more world than this once uh, they implement more. It might just be this tiny little. Oh, that goes farther than I thought. This tiny little uh, thingamajig. Tiny little world. What's this? Oh, sun's coming up. Oh, pff. why don't you sleep in a bed? I got five beds there. Why don't you sleep in one? Or maybe she's the one that doesn't own a bed. I think maybe all the others are claimed. But these people, they need something to do. So we're gonna build a simple room again, just to show off. Which I know this is a little bugged still because I can tell them to start building, and they'll build it. But once they get up to the roof. They won't build anymore. It's like they can't get the roofs built. Oh, there he goes. Is he doing? Yep. Look at that. Elena hunted and wakes groggy from sleeping on the cold, hard, unforgiving earth. Well, you should have laid in the bed. So, yeah, look. she's carrying something heavy, and he's groggy. But not our fault. You can't directly control the people. You just tell, you just say, okay, I need these things done, and then they'll go about doing it themselves. Actually, I said, hey, I need this little simple room built. So these guys went ahead and started doing it on their own. Okay, there's a bed. The last bed is going down right there. But we got chairs now. Place the chair. Rotate it. One there. Another chair. Rotate it and put it there. And look at her building those chairs. Chairs must be fast to build. Which they only take one resource, so they should be fast to build. Okay, turn around. Put that there. Look at her work using that saw. And just dropping stuff. That's alright. Put a chair there. Two more chairs. Oops. One there. Oh, is that her last chair? I think it is. Alright, we're gonna have to give her something else to do now. Alright, there we go. Oh, it's not perfectly symmetrical. So. I'm going to move it so it is. Because I'm weird like that. See, oh look, they're using their chairs! And she's eating her food that's back behind her. It's an alpha, people. There's gonna be some bugs. No problem, though. Look at that. Well, there's no one's building yet. Oh, look. Yeah, you deserve food. You built all those beds and everything. Ooh, framey. Ooh, framey. Why is it so framey? No, no, again. Alpha people. Plate of berries. To do. Invent whipped cream. Why aren't you working? This may have bugged out a little bit since nobody is doing anything. Or maybe they're just waiting for others to finish eating. I'm not sure. But, since it's getting a bit framey, I think I will call that. Oops, I was in the wrong keys. Anyway, 
I'll call that. This is Stone Hearth. Um, like I said, it is in very early alpha now. Uh, I'll post a link down in the comments to where you can check it out yourselves. Oh! Oh, no. There, there they go. What are they doing now? She moved the chair. Good. She's placing the final chair. What are these guys doing? Well, now they're getting back to work. Well, let's give Elaine some more to do. Let's see, before we go, let's see a sword and a buckler. Just because I want to see him. Um, yeah, I won't do anything of those other things yet. See, as they go up, they build this scaffolding, which takes wood, and then they build the building, which takes even more wood. But I've noticed that when they're done building, they'll take the scaffolding down and get that wood back. So that's good. Not just wasting wood. Oh, there's a sword. Nope. Oh, he picked up the sword. Oh, he's just putting it in the stockpile. Wooden sword notched from many smites. So... Looks like I can't make anybody pick it up yet. But that's okay. I just kind of want to see him. Wooden buckler, better than using an oak branch to defend your ego. Very true. Is that a, a reference to Thorn Oaken Shield using the wooden branch? Maybe. Alright, you don't have anything to do. See, she has a job now. She's a carpenter, so that's all she does. She won't come and build with the rest of the workers. She's too special for that, apparently. And she's got a little sheep friend. So fluffy! You know, it looks like the sheep will need something made. But, the sheep can't talk. We can't interact with him yet, so we don't need what, know what he needs. Maybe... We need... Pick a fence. Ten picket fences and a gate. And that can be for the sheep. We'll make a little a little area for the sheep to hang out. But with that, I am gonna call it. Uh, this has been Stone Hearth. I've been acorn. Okay, she's working away. Building those fences. Fence posts, fence gates. No, not a gate. That's just the fence. And they're gonna put it over in the stockpile. Anyway, this is Stone Hearth. Um it's a cool game. I can't wait until there's more. Um, probably when there's a lot more and I can do a lot more things, I'll possibly make a series out of it. Or if it just if there's not a lot to do, but there's some cool new stuff that they add, I might make another video like this, just kind of showing off. But I'm really excited to play this when it comes out, like fully, and it has a lot more stuff to do. But for now, this is pretty much it. I think it's a nice little little preview of what's to come. Uh, just showing the Kickstarter backers what what their money went to. Um, so yeah, uh, if you want, check it out. Uh, I'll post a link down in the comments, and you can experiment with your own little fireplace and uh, simple buildings. But for now, I'm going to say goodbye. So I will see you guys next time. Bye.